Well, our station is going to the kittens. An incredible rescue by some of our coworkers today. It started when sports director Dan Lucas heard a meow during his drive into the station. Turns out he had a hitchhiker that was stuck in his wheel well. Social media reporter Lila Gross shows you the rescue in today's digital download. There it is. Okay, so we know Kitty's in here. The key now is tuna? Tuna. I'm that's thinking what tuna. That's what everyone's saying. All right, tuna. tuna. All right, guys. So we're going to run and get some tuna across the street, and we will come back and try this again. What we're going to do is open this puppy up. Oh, yeah. We get him just to smell the tuna so he knows it's here. There's a little Paul over there, too. Oh, my God. He's so cute. He's little. Really, he's really little. He's a baby. I got his butt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Up here comes his head. Someone's got his butt in his head. Yeah. Oh, 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 I think he just got trapped in Dan Lucas's car trying to get warmer playing, and then Dan took off and he survived. We ought to call him lucky, but he's just precious. Precious. Oh, Listen. I know. That's you can a hear him. Lucky kid. Now, we don't know if it's a boy or girl, right? We don't know. We haven't figured that this out is yet. This is so new, right? So and we got to get it to the vet. Uh, but a mate, it's loud. It's not loud. Can you hear it? <laughs> It's <laughs> super cute, too. So I this... think Lucky's a good name for that kid. Yeah, we've been going back and forth on the da names. Little Dan Lucas is running around, too, in our What's newsroom the... today. What's the plan? Are we going to try to find it at home? Yeah, or? so he is still looking for a home. So if anyone's looking for a new little friend, you can get in touch with us on Facebook or at WFLA.com. We'd love to hear from you. Well, he made a trip in Dan's car for, what did we figure, 20 minutes? Yeah. That's unbelievable. Yeah. yeah. But totally. he has been the... Uh... The mascot today, for sure. Yeah, station. Josh, the I'm new station pet. You're not going to take this kitten home because you just I did would. the same yeah, thing. Yeah, this is amazing. This cat was found in the wheel well. Well, on Father's Day, my wife and I were coming back from Orlando from Father's Day celebration, and we got out in a McDonald's parking lot. I swear, I had to get a oh. chocolate shake. And this little guy was running across the parking lot, soaking wet, without a mom or anything, in the middle of the night. And my oh. wife says, "We got to get this cat." So we ran outside. The cat ran into my wheel well. I couldn't find him, and then finally found it in the wheel well. So, well, we're taking it home. So, so you have a new cat. You we went to the vet. This is Mickey, named after McDonald's, and my, my daughter can say Mickey, so it seemed like it was appropriate. <laughs> uh, we have two dogs now, two cats. All of them are rescues, so we're at capacity. Otherwise, I would take this guy. <laughs> but this guy needs a home. Somebody's gonna want that. Somebody. Cat. We yes. hope so. We hope so. We're just glad he made it out safe and sound. Uh, oh well, thanks for bringing yeah. him on or taking bringing her. Care. We haven't quite figured him or her. Maybe <laughs> a vet can help us out. Yeah. Thanks, Lila. Perfect. Thank you. Thank you.